Hey everyone, so today we are doing a very exciting video. Last November I had this idea and it was basically to try a bunch of colored contacts that are like Halloween themed. We are going to get a little spooky today. I think Halloween themed contact lenses are so cool. Like the cat eye, the red, all different colors. I just can't believe there's even an invention that can change your eye color. I'm super excited to do this video. I can already tell that I'm going to destroy my eye makeup because I'm not the best at putting in contact lenses but wishful thinking. So yeah, today basically we're just gonna be trying on some really crazy contact lenses. I wanna see how they look and I think it would be a fun video. I don't know, I just think it would be fun for the Halloween season. I will link all the lenses I try on down below, but just so you guys know, I bought these with my own money and I'm not working with this brand. They did reach out and want to work with me, but I ended up not working with them. So I bought these with my own money. Whatever I say about them is honest, but I don't think this will be much of a review. I think it'll be more just for fun because I like can't Wait. But okay, let's get into this. I have to go wash my hands. So let's see. The first ones look like they're going to be, well, I can't really tell because everything's written in like a different language. But here are the first ones. They have a little sticker on the side, but I can't read it. It's got a little gray swatch, but I don't know if these are gray. Like I said, I ordered these, or I didn't say this. I ordered these back in November, so I kind of forget. Oh. <laughs> So the first contact lenses we have to try on are these yellow cat eyes. These are going to be so scary. I'm actually so nervous. I really hope that this brand is legit. I've tried their contact lenses before, but I mean, I don't know how to classify things as being like eye safe, but I'm hoping that they are, so. Also, I got my no prescription, so let's just open these up. How do I do this? <laughs> I don't know how to do this, what the heck? I don't know how to get into this. Oh my gosh, is that how you do it? I just ripped off like the packaging. How do I open these? I literally have to Google how to open contact lenses. All right, I'm gonna watch a video on how to open contact lenses. Contact lenses are a great way to enhance your- All right, I'm so happy that video was on the internet, but I did it wrong from the get-go. My mom's gonna be so mad. There, I'm getting one. I did not think this was gonna be the difficult part. Getting it open? <laughs> Why? Okay, I got it. Imagine struggling that much just to get the contacts open. So keep in mind, you guys, they have like pull tabs and metal caps. <sighs> okay, so let's open this up. Oh, there, now it's easy to open up. So I have to get the contact out. Dear God, this is difficult. It like doesn't want to come out. I'm gonna lose it. All right, I got the contact lens out. All right, I think, so I have worn contacts before. You're supposed to just have it so it looks like a bowl. I am not feeling confident about this. I started off not good. Okay, get in my eye. Oh my goodness, it looks so scary. And like when I close my eyes, I can see like a little bit of the yellow, but okay. First one done, only took me 45 minutes. I'm pretty sure this is not how you get a contact lens out. Let me just grab you. Let's pray that it goes on semi-smoothly. Oh my gosh, I am crying. I'm crying in lizard. <laughs> so here's, what is going on? Can someone explain to me why the pupils, I thought like with cat eyes they would be like that, but they're kind of like this. Like, <laughs> do you see what I mean? By the way, my eyes are watering because I just poked them a million times, but they aren't hurting. Like, I actually can't feel these contact lenses. I thought that these ones would be like, kind of, what is the word? Kind of thick, but they're not, so that's good. But they don't sit how I thought they would. I thought they were gonna be like straight up and down cat eyes, but they're definitely like tilted in. But okay, here are the first ones. 
fairly smooth. What do you guys think? I think we're gonna call this one lizard realness. So let's get a close up. Okay. <laughs> Next. Now taking them out is, is just as difficult for me. <sighs> I thought this video was gonna be such a good idea and now I'm not so sure. And look, I actually got them back in their containers. Okay, so the lizard eyes, I think I'll give them like a nine out of 10. They'd get a 10 out of 10 if they were straight, but okay. Next. So all the crazy ones are like in these packages. So I have one that looks like it's supposed to be like actually worn on an everyday basis if people want to have different colored eyes natural looking. So here they are. So I don't remember what color they are and they don't really say. I kind of am gonna guess a green just by looking at them. These are easy to open. Ooh, these ones feel a lot thinner. All right, wish me luck. Okay, she didn't want to go in. What did that do? Did that do anything? Look at that! Is that a clear contact? Did I buy a clear contact lens with zero prescription? Okay, no. For real though, I do see they lightened them a little bit. Like a little bit more green in this eye. Do you see that? Honestly, I'm gonna make an executive decision and say that's not worth putting in the other one because it's a lot of pain for not much change, so let's move on. Okay, we've got another one. Okay, so these are red. These are like super, super scary looking. They look like demon eyes, so we'll give them a go. Find the small perforation. I'm also scared like grabbing this little metal because I don't want any of it on my hands when I'm sticking contacts in my eyes. You feel me? Okay, same diff. Let's do this. Oh, that's the wrong way. This is super hard to explain, but basically if it's like folded the wrong way, it won't be nice for your eyes. There we go. We got the cereal bowl. Let's begin. Oh. Oh. You know what this makes me think of actually? I have seen someone try contacts. I think it was on Clever TV like years ago. She was trying contacts and she just couldn't do it and that's how I feel right now. <laughs> like, I just can't do it. I'm not giving up though. I'm gonna get this. Ow. <laughs> you guys. Actually, hold on. No, you know what? I'm not giving up. I'm getting the other one in. I want to make this video. This was a good idea, right? Everyone's gonna be like, this is actually really dangerous and like unsafe for your eyes. Trust me. I know. <sighs> All right, cereal bowl. Get in my eyes. It looks even more psychotic right now because one eye is red. See? This is a perfect example of when you stay committed, it pays off. <laughs> this looks psychotic. This looks so scary, actually. Hold on. Like, with my bun and, like, my black turtleneck, I look so crazy. Okay, I need to send a picture. So these, I will give a actual 10 out of 10. They look exactly like I wanted them to. Um... They actually, I don't even hardly feel them. The only thing I feel is like a crumb or something up in this one, so. So yeah, okay. I'm gonna take these out now. Oh, it feels so good when you get them out. Like, it's just so nice. Big shout out to people who wear like colored contacts like every day. I know there's some like makeup gurus that wear like the blue ones every day. Just like huge shout out. I don't know how you do it. I do think that like normal contacts do feel like thinner because I did wear contacts before back like in grade eight or something for just like a year. And other than that, I just didn't wear contacts or glasses. But I know from experiences that usually colored contacts feel thicker than like actual contacts. So just keep that in mind. Like I understand I'm being dramatic. Trust me, I know. Next pair, let's see what we got. This is the last pair. Oh my goodness, these are so pretty. They're purple. I'm so excited. Let's 
do the old rip into these. Okay, got them ready to go. Clean, washed fingies. Bowl. Let's party. <laughs> my poor eyes. Oh, oh my goodness. I'm becoming a professional contact lens putter in her. That didn't even hurt. Maybe I spoke too soon and it kind of hurts. All right. Next one, please go in as smoothly as this one. It's so weird how it like finds its way onto your pupil. My goodness. They're in! Ah, dry the tears, they're in! Oh my goodness, and they match my headband. Ooh. These ones are definitely something I can get on board with. They're like black around the outside, then purple, then pink right in the center. And when I close my eyes, I can only see a little bit of purple in this eye. So maybe it's uneven on this side, but that is no big deal. No problem. I really like these. They kind of give the effect that like circle lenses do and the fact that there's like the dark layer. So it kind of makes my eyes look like bigger, giving these a 10 out of 10. Wow, I actually really like this. Like if you were a butterfly or like a fairy and it was purple and pink, you could wear these and just like the added touch. Love them. All right, you guys, so I really hope you enjoyed this really quick video, actually. I didn't, like, I don't know what I thought, but there was only four contact lenses for me to try. I think I had, like, two more, but when I was looking for them, they just, like, disappeared. That's what happens when you order things in November and don't film till October. But okay, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I basically could title this Mia Struggling with Contacts for 10 minutes straight, so. But anyways, thank you guys so, so much for watching. If you guys are excited for the Halloween series that I have going on, all October is going to be Halloween videos, and I'm so excited. So let me know down below if you are also excited, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!